what is up my crazy subscriber this is Joe King John City 4 and hopefully you guys had a wonderful weekend I'm pretty sure most of you guys did spend time with your families and also pop some fireworks out there oh shit oh Lord Jesus 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 Lord Jesus oh Jesus oh Jesus Christ oh Jesus Jesus oh Lord Jesus now, I know some of you guys did actually go out to, like, uh, you know, spend time with your families and all that stuff, but some of you guys, well, I showed up back home from a party, like, around 3 in the morning. I went back home, I turned on my PS4 because I wanted to fall asleep after watching the movie, and then I saw my friends list, and I was like, bruh, are you kidding me? 24 people online from our friends list. I was like, what the hell? Most of you guys don't... I'm pretty sure most of you guys have family. Come on, man. Like, most of you guys are younger than me, too. Like, most of the, most of the people on my friends list. And I was like, go out, people. Go pop some fireworks. I don't know. I know most of you guys are not that you know, old to, like, pop fireworks. Come on, man. Don't give me that excuse. Or some of you guys do live in city limits. That's why you guys ended up playing, you know, some PS4. But And I would understand, but, like, come on, you know. Let's go out with your families and have a good time, people. And I, I was like, oh, my God, you know, I should send them all something. It was like my drunken self. And I was like, oh, my God, I should tell them all something funny in the inbox or something. And I did. Some of you guys did actually receive a message from me. And most of, most of them were like normal. So um, for those people who got the message, you know, I'm sorry, but uh, I was a little drunk. But uh, it was a good message overall. I want to wish you guys a happy new year. And uh, hopefully we get to play later on in the future for more content in my channel or your channel whatever you guys are doing nowadays you know let me know and i'll pretty much jump in and play with you all it's just that i've been busy for the past month it's been holiday holidays all over the damn week but now i'm thinking i'm available for the whole damn month now but anyways now moving on to the main topic of today after all this distraction of the new year's thing um what are my plans for 2017 Ooh, nobody gives a shit so 2017 what plans do i have for 2017 first of all i would like to say this real quick first person shooting gaming is not going to be around for a while because you guys know what i think about call of duty but the thing is though call of duty will be showing up next year a hundred percent no matter if it's going to be futuristic sci-fi aliens desert cowboys and aliens or fucking hobos versus you know rich people i don't give a damn i will be going 100 percent next year's call of duty so when there's news about the call of duty 2017 i will probably be reporting it on it too i'll be looking for the like the weapons revealed and all those map thingies and you know i'll be going all out for call of duty next year but for this year call of duty infinite warfare is a huge no now the only other fps game that i'll probably be accepting will be overwatch once i get it back because i sold it a long time ago and that's why i stopped showing it so uh overwatch will be coming back like around february or maybe even sooner depends on the situation so uh that's that will be the only time fps gaming will be coming back but for uh other things you know for other plans my first plan coming this january which is already january already it's like uh, 1 2 2017 today and, uh, you know, my plan for January is to buy Resident Evil Biohazard. If you guys haven't seen the trailers or any gameplays of that game, you guys are missing out on a lot. It's a reboot of the franchise. Well, it kind of looks for me like a reboot because there's no style like that, like how they're playing it. If you guys haven't seen any footage about Resident Evil 7 Biohazard, I suggest to search it up right now on YouTube. That gameplay style was not in the previous Resident Evil games. And I'm a big fan of Resident Evil. I've been playing Resident Evil since Resident Evil 2. I never got to play the first one or the third one, but I got to play the second one, the fourth one, uh, Revelations 1 and 2, and also Resident Evil 6, Resident Evil 5 for a bit. So yeah, I pretty much played a lot of Resident Evil games, and I'm telling you the best one so far has been Resident Evil 2, and also Resident Evil, uh, what's, what's, the other, that, what's that other game? I forgot the other, the other freaking game. It was something about files. Oh, Outbreak. Resident Evil Outbreak was pretty much awesome. So um, I'm a big fan about that game. And I'm going to buy Resident Evil 7 uh, Biohazard. And I will be showing it here on my channel for the whole month of January. 20, January 24th will be the release day for Resident Evil 7. And uh, I'm hoping for you guys to enjoy it. I'm not sure. But I'm not going to force anybody to watch it. But that's what I'm going to be working on once that game comes out. And then moving on to the month of February 2017, there's going to be another game coming out during that month. And it's going to be 
uh, Horizon Zero Dawn. Now that one is an open world game, kind of similar to uh, Far Cry Primal, but with robots. So it's gonna be an amazing game overall. And I was expecting that game since like last year. I've been watching a lot of trailers since it, like, it first launched like two years ago. And I was so excited. I was like, this is the game to fucking buy and play every single day. So hopefully it's not a letdown too, because you know it is a PS4 exclusive and you know how the PS4 exclusive have been over the past few years. They haven't been impacting enough, so. I am a little bit worried at this point, but hopefully it's an amazing game. Most of you guys do not know what Horizon Zero Dawn is. Make sure you Google it or just YouTube it, and you'll see some of the trailers and you know images of the, images of the game. Uh, the next game I would like to talk about will be the month of March. Now, the month of March, there's going to be another game coming out, and it's going to be an open world game shooter, and it's similar to The Division. I'm pretty sure most of you guys know what I'm referring to here. And it's going to be Ghost Recon Wildlands. Now, Ghost Recon Wildlands, for sure, for sure, it's going to be the prime of my channel. It's going to be the prime time of this year, 2017. I will be revolving my whole content around that game because, you know, The Division was amazing. I actually enjoyed the game. Along with Grouchy, you know, this other person that I played with in my series, uh, he was awesome. I was awesome too. We were like uh, fucking scavenging for stuff and it was an amazing experience overall. So I wonder what's gonna, you know, happen with Ghost Recon Wildlands with the same kind of style, but with vehicles and, you know, more character customization compared to like Division. It's gonna be an amazing experience for sure. So. Ghost Recon's Wildlands will be on my list. Uh, Resident Evil 7 is going to be on my list. And also Horizon Zero Dawn is going to be on my list. So those, those are my three main games over the next three months. And that's what's going to be shown here in my channel. For sure, most of you guys are going to be confused because, you know, I subscribe here for Call of Duty. No, this is not going to be any until next year. So that's all I wanted to talk about today, guys. Hopefully you guys enjoyed the video and also the gameplay in the background. It is some Dragon Age Inquisition, just in case you were wondering. And uh, well, it's going to be amazing for the next three months, for sure. A lot of different games, different genres. And I'm expecting to like switch around this channel because, you know, we've been in a slump for the longest time. So uh, it's going to be an amazing year overall, for sure. 2017 is going to be amazing. So that is it. Subscribe for more. You guys want to see more crazy stuff.